Hello and welcome to a Tabletop Bellhop Cardboard Coat Check. I am Mo Tuzano, the Tabletop Bellhop, your cardboard concierge, working with you to make your game nights better. Today what I'm going to be doing is opening up a copy of this. This is the Space Box from Escape Well, which is a German company that makes various types of wooden puzzles. In particular, what I have really enjoyed from them are their wooden, what they call escape boxes, or they call them escape room in a box experiences. I just personally think of them as wooden puzzle boxes. Uh, these are laser cut birch wood boxes that all um, have various puzzles and things you have to move and twist and turn and figure out and dials to get open to get to your prize inside. What I love about these is not only they're a cool toy on their own, they make awesome gift boxes to give someone else a small gift that will fit inside. Because then you don't really give them the gift, you give them the box that they're going to have to solve first. So this is, from what they tell me, their most difficult box to date the space box. So all I'm going to do is crack this open. I'm going to show you the various six sides of this cube and kind of show uh, what things are. But what I am not going to be doing today is solving this. I am going to also resist the urge to fiddle with it too much while I'm unboxing it because I got to say all of these wooden puzzles, you put one in front of someone, they can't help but fiddle with them. Step one, though, is going to be opening up the box. But I do have to thank Escape Well for sending a review copy of this. And you can also check out my other Escape Well reviews um, on YouTube and on the blog where I've looked at some of their other easier puzzles. All right, here you have the space box box. It says the rescue of humanity is so close and it looks like it's on fire. Danger, Will Robinson. Um, there's some information here on the back, like the publisher, how difficult this is and so on. They expect this to take you a, an hour to solve. That is a long time to figure this out. Note, once you do know it, you can reset the puzzle. Not a lot to see here box-wise. So we're gonna crack it open and get to the fun stuff. All right, what do we have on top? First off, we have this, which says, Handmade by Ivana. So it lets you know who assembled your box. And there is some information here um, saying, Dear friend, welcome to Escape World, etc." Then we get to what the quote-unquote instructions uh, which gives you a little intro story of what's going on, basically. And it's in German on this side, English on this side. And this includes a QR code you can use to go look up to get hints if you get stuck. Uh, this is something new I've been seeing from Escape Well. I guess they have an app now, and there's a copy of the app. I'll even leave this QR code because it's a free app up long enough if anyone wants to scan it. So it's, a, it's the Quest Puzzle app. And then we get right to the game. So you can immediately see the bottom of the box. Obviously, this wants to slide here, but you're not going to be able to slide that until this is out of the way. And wow, I wonder how to get that out of the way. So we're going to use that tab to open this up. We're going to move this out of the way. Then we're going to start by flipping it completely over. So we flipped it completely over, and we have a grid of letters. Fascinating already. There's something here. You can hear stuff wobbling around inside the box. Then we're going to turn to the various sides. Wow, okay. These really want to come out. Like, this is literally sliding as I open it. Oh, look, yeah, see there's stuff on the bottom, too, just sliding out. Okay, neat. Um, so we have a number of numbers here pointing to the bottom. So possibly the way to solve this is to have these numbers showing or something to get this piece out. We're going to turn to this side. We've got a dial here that turns that shows a bunch of symbols. we got all kinds of little things to pull on here, like all kinds. Oh, this doesn't want to go back in. Oh, okay. There's other slots here. We've got the door. I think this is what we're trying to open, is this door here. Looks like it's got a number of layers inside, you can kind of see. Then we have this side, which doesn't show you much. It just tells you to look at the bottom. But maybe this slides off. And then we're back to this side. So, fascinating box. Um, wow. This one doesn't seem to have much theme to it. Um, there are other escape room boxes seem to have a lot more detail on them. This seems way more puzzle. Yeah, all kinds. Again, I gotta stop. I'm gonna start fiddling with it. I don't want to fiddle with it. There's pips and numbers and dials and... Oh my. All right. There you have it. The the box that's already... It's like... See, I must have changed something. I can't... There we go. I'm trying to put everything back in. So, one more flip. We're gonna... Bottom. Side. 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 And again, stuff's like moving around and popping out side, top, or possibly the other way around. There you have it. The space box from Escape Welt, which I'm not going to bother putting back into its original box.
All right. I am just amused by the amount of things like falling out and poking. Yeah, see, poking out. Well, well, I'm just trying to show this off. This looks fascinating. All I want to do now is is sit here and ignore you and everyone else listening and start playing around with this, trying to figure it out. There's buttons. There's all kinds of things to play with. There's even a keyhole down here that I, I want to stick a key in. You can see the keyhole. So this right here is the um, the space box from Escape Welt. Their hardest puzzle ever. Um, all kinds of things going on here. Like I said, stuff's like popping out all over the place. Um, there's some math on here. It says 12, 69, 49, 79. I really have no clue what's going on. Um, but puzzle box. See, I'm getting distracted. I'm trying not to get distracted. Puzzle box from Escape Well. They make fantastic wooden puzzles. This being their hardest one. Can't wait to try to crack this open. Um, because we're not that experienced with these, I have a feeling it's going to take longer than the half an hour listed on the box. Thank you for joining me for this unboxing video. If you do decide to head over to escapewelt.com and possibly pick up a copy of this, remember to use our code BELLHOP. One word to save 10%. Um, when I do get this thing open, we'll be doing up a review at tabletopbellhop.com and as well as on the Tabletop Bellhop Gaming Podcast, which you can find on your podcatcher of choice. Thank you for joining me. Good day and game on.